as always, it's great to have your company. We've got a fantastic low-impact workout for you, body-burning workout. But first, of course, we have to warm up. So we've got our legs apart. We're just going to start off with a couple of quick stretches before we get underway. One more to go here. We're going to take a stretch up right over one side and just lean over. And just hold it here. Look up behind me. Hi, Michelle. I'm sorry, I didn't even look to see who was there. Ran straight in. <laughs> Let's take it right up the other way again. Lean right over, get a nice stretch happening right up through the sides. Hold that for four more. One, two, three, and four. Bring it around. Walk your feet in. I better check who I've got this side as well. Oh, it's Effie. Hi, Effie. How are you doing? Looking good in red too, I might add. Ah, oh, thank you. Yeah, the old faithful red shorts. They're serving me well, I think, on this show. <laughs> four more to go. Here we go. This is one, and two, and three. Little toe tap in front. Where we go? We're going to push it down. Shake the hands out. Just loosen up the body. Remember, aerobics is fun. We don't want to be too tense. Get a little bit happy. Put a smile on that face of yours as well. Let's keep this going for eight more counts. This is one and two. Four more to go, please. Two toe taps on each side now. The moment you're doing one, so here we go for the two. How about we add a just a little bit of hip movement in this as well? You ready? Way we go. We're going to push it down like this. Just a little bit. This is as funky as we get, all right? Your own style's fine. Four more. One. And two. Come on, shake it out. Three. One more. Take a deep breath up, nice and tall. Where we go. And take it down. One more to go. That's the way. Take it down with a side tap on the right and then the left. Now, we're going to use this move a lot today, so we're just that's why we're warming it up right now. Take the arms out wide. Stretch out through the chest. Keep this going for four more times. Count it as one. And two. Final one coming up. Okay, two toe taps on each side instead of one. Here we go for two. Now on this move as well, try not to lean too far forward. You want to be up tall. It's a great feedback. back. No forward flexion. Last two. Get ready for four on each side, gang. Here we go for four. And one. Change it now. Excellent. Let's do four again. Where we go. One, two, three, and four. Other side. Take it back to two, way we go, two on each side. And now bring it back down to one. Here we go, just the singles. Okay, with the arms, just try and stretch out each side on this one. Open up through the chest, and also squat down through the legs a little bit here as well. So we're really warming up. Eight counts, seven. Come on, side to side. We'll do eight more again. Lean right over. Try and get the feet out fairly wide on this movement. Four, three, two, take out the arms. Shake it out. Ah, oh, breath is going up already. Okay, we're going to glue the feet down here. Push down. Four more. One. Get ready for that deep breath up again. Here we go. Stretch up tall, all the way up. Take it down. One more to go. Hold it in a down position, and we're going to release the back. And again. So the idea is to curl up, release the lower back, and then flatten it back out again. Eight counts to go. Just enjoy this movement. Last four, then we get a hold. One, two, are you ready to hold it? Here we go, hold here. Get a nice straight chin. I'll put the head down there if you like. But I'm gonna keep looking at you. Okay, release and roll all the way up. Walk the feet in, take your time. Take one leg back, stretch out for a nice calf stretch. The reason why I won't do a lot of stretches now, is even though it's low impact, we've got a lot of lunging and taps happening here which can stress out the calves and the ankles. So we want to give them a super stretch now. Bend down through that leg as well. Hold for eight counts. Try and push the heel down even though you, you know you can't get it down there. Okay, chain sides. Big push down. If you want, you can lean forward onto that leg. Try not to lean forward like this though. Keep stretching out the calf. Four counts and we're going to bend up. You ready? What is this song saying? Can't quite make out these words. Four, three, two, bring it in and walk it out again. All right, back to the movement. On four, take a walk forward for four counts. You ready? Four, three, two, one. Bit of a clap. Take it right back. Okay, how about double clap on the way back? Here we go. Boom, boom. One here. Two claps go here. It's a bit like Scatman John. What was the hit that Scatman John had a little while ago? Oh, the Scatman, that's what it was. He's probably thinking, yeah, what are you saying? <laughs> That's a song. 
<laughs> and again. Okay, two more to go. Final one coming up. Get ready for a great vibe movement over to the right hand side. Here we go. Straight back again. And again. Now I'm just previewing the moves that we're going to do. They're all these base moves, but we're going to link them together and have a bit of fun as well. Let's go back to the side taps, right leg and left leg. Here we go, out to the side. Okay, two on each side. Way we go for the four. Here we go. Four counts. Change sides. I'm going to leave you with these moves, and when we come back, we'll get into our routine work. Back to doubles, guys. How are you accounting? Simple enough question, it seems. What's four and four? Eight counts. You'll probably notice we do everything in eight counts in aerobics. It makes it fairly easy for you. We're going to bend the rules just a little bit today. Instead of doing four and four, we're going to do three, two and two and three. What's three plus two plus three? Still eight, right? You're going to count with me. Walk it out. It's, it's uh, a fairly basic workout, but of course, just by changing it, makes it a little bit more, quite more interesting on the mind. Anyway, let's see how we go here. Walking forward, where we go. These are fours. I won't stress you out just yet. Now, did you, was that a yes that you can count? <laughs> we'll see. Two more to go. One more to go. We're going to get back to our four taps on each side. So four taps on the right side. Change sides now. Okay, and walk forward for four. Take it back to four. Same thing again. So at the moment, it's four on each side. Gang, you ready? Let's go again. Four on each side. Change it now. And get ready to walk forward. Walk forward now. Now on those movements, of course, I want you to make it as large as you can. Keep walking forward for me. Now I want you to do four and four each side again while I do a small variation, okay? Not yet. One more to go. Are you ready? Let's go, watch my variation. I'm gonna do three, two singles, and then three. And then walk forward. Okay, so it's three, two singles, and three. So everyone get that one? You gotta think. Let's go, everyone do three. Three, two, one, two singles, and three on the other side, and then walk forward. See, it's not that difficult. One more to go. You ready? Make it huge! Here we go. Out to the side for three. Two singles. Out to the side for three. And then walk it forward. Take it back. How about we do it on the other leg as well? So we're going to go on the left leg. You ready? Three taps. Three to go. Single, single. And three. All right, how about we go forward again? Walk it forward. Nice and easy on that one. One more time. Right side, let's go. Make it huge! Two singles and three. Walk it forward again. One more time. If you've got a lot of room, I really want you to march it out as big as you can. Three on the left. Two singles and three. Walk it forward. Take it back. Keep that going. One more to go. Hold it here. Walk it out. Leg curls to the right hand side. Up we go. Now we're going to add the leg curl to this movement, but at the moment we're going to do eight of them. That's all you have to know. <laughs> okay? We'll change it a little bit later on. Four more to go. Get ready for the three toe taps. Three taps. Two singles. Three taps. Now we do the eight leg curls this way again. Eight leg curls. Eight. Seven. Four more to go. Now get ready for the three taps. Three taps left leg. Two singles. Three taps. Get ready for the eight leg curls back onto the right hand side. Eight counts, seven. Now come down really low, work it as hard as you can. You ready to go again? Tap it out. Three, two singles, and three on the other side. Get ready for your leg curls. Way we go. Eight counts. Come down low, put the legs right up to the back side and enjoy the movement. Get ready for the tap. Way we go. Two singles, and three. Eight leg curls. Eight, seven, four more to go. Get ready for a walk forward. Let's go forward now. How'd you go? Not too bad, I hope. 
We're going to keep the same thing now. We're not going to change it. But I'm going to add a little variation on the leg curl. I want you to stay in the front for the first ones. Get ready for the toe tap again. Let's go. Three, two singles, and three. Eight leg curls. Watch my leg curls. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and tap down. Also, all I did was add a bit of a hinge. Get ready for the three again. Eight leg curls. So you can do it this time or next time. It doesn't really matter. All we're doing is adding that L shape. Hold it here for four more. Three. Walk it forward now. Go. How do you guys go? It's so so. <laughs> Have it up the back there. Okay. Cool. How about you at home? Hopefully a big yes. Let's try it again. Toe tap out to the side. Where we go. Chain sides. Three to go. Hang it off to the other side now with the L shape. Now practice this move to the break. We're going to leave you with it. When we come back, we'll add one more piece to the routine. Three taps, gang. Okay, you'll be really happy to know that all we're adding is a grapevine to the routine. Let's walk it out, here we go. Now the guys can't say they don't know a grapevine, can they? Yes, no. Of course you do. Okay, march it out. Four more to go. One, two, let's go. Grapevine over, straight back. How about we pick that little leg up at the end of each grapevine? All right, four more. One and two. Three, final one, leg curl on the spot. Keep to the front of the leg curl here. Now, we're gonna do three leg curls, I mean three great lines, two leg curls. Not yet, let me count you in. Four, and three, and two. Here we go, three great lines, one each way. That's one, two, one more. Hold it to the leg curl here, and now we go back to on the great line. Three, and two, one more. Leg curl here and hold. Back to the other direction. Three times always. Two, one more, and leg curl. Back to the other direction. Everyone okay with this move? Now, I, I can assure you it's not gonna change at all. Back to the other direction. But the thing that is gonna change, of course, is the direction. One more. Back to the other direction again. Three, two, one, leg curl. Take a walk forward now. Straight back again. Now, I want you to stay to the front while I show you. Okay, so let's go back to the grapevines now. You ready? Grapevine over. Three, two, one, leg curl. Other direction again. Three, two, one, leg curl. You guys keep doing the same thing. What's the variation? Three, two, one, and leg curl come around to the front. Watch one more time. Think about making a square pattern. So making a box. Leg curls come around to the front. Everyone, let's go. Come to us, face the back, leg curl to the front. So you're making a big square. Other way. That's it, yeah? Looking good. Face the back, face the side, leg curl. One more time, each direction. That looks great. And again, face the back. So you just have to twice for a little bit there, leg curl. One more time, other direction. All righty, one more. Everyone get ready to walk forward. Here we go now. High clap. Double clap down low. Here we go, up high. Woo! Down low. And again, now you've got nothing else to learn. One more time. We're gonna go back to the grapevine movement. Four, three, two, one. Over we go. To the square. Face the back. See you for a bit. Leg curl turn around. And the other direction. Now let's move it out a bit. Come on. Step it out. Walk it forward now. The gang look good, so how about we add the routine together? Oh, we've got the high clap and then the low clap on the double. Okay, here we go, hop. Did you remember the first move? The three taps? Let's go three taps, here we go. Two singles, three taps, eight leg curls. And you can add the hinge here if you like. Excellent. Okay, tap down, left hand leg. Three, two, one, two singles, and three, 
Get ready for the leg curls. You've got eight of them. Count them down with me. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. The box weight line now. Three of them. That's one. That's two. Leg curl to the front, gang. Cool. Let's get back the other way. The other way. Get the direction. <laughs> one more time. Get ready to walk forward. Let's go forward now. Here we go. Up. Down low. Up high. Down low. And again. Come on. One more to go. Up we go. Step touch here. Hold it here. Make step touch as large as you can. Arms are big. Legs are big. We've got our mats here. We're going to try and step to the outside of each mat. Now obviously, you, or you may not have one at home, but what, imagine you do, and step it out. Come on, low impact is high on energy. Four, three from the top. Tap it out now. Three counts. Two singles. And three. Okay, the eight leg curls go here. Count them down if it makes it a bit easier for you. Okay, toe tap left hand side for three. Two singles again. Three on the other side. The eight leg curls. How are you guys going? Okay? Yeah? Cool. It is hot. <laughs> Great vine. Let's go. Face away from us. See you in a bit. Leg curl turn around to the front. Here we are again and back the other direction. Three times only. Two. Get ready for a step touch. Step touch goes here. Where we go? Out and down. Come down low. Come on. Way out wide. Okay. Make it a bit smaller. Shake it out. Good job. You did really well. What we can do is cool it down and see you right back for a really well deserved stretch. Now, in your busy schedule, maybe you can't catch us every single day. But we do have fantastic videos where you can catch us anytime is convenient for you. You can pick them up from Chandler's, David Jones, and Target and other department stores and video outlets. So grab them. There's low impact, high impact body conditioning. There's a whole assortment. They got your name on them. Go grab them. Okay, let's get you into a nice stretch routine now. Take your legs apart. Go for a fairly wide stance on this and then avoid locking out the knees. Whenever you're doing aerobics, always try to avoid this. As a matter of fact, even when you're working during the day or standing around the house, always avoid that lockout. Very, the knees are very complex joint. Just keep it slightly bent, it's perfect body position. Take one arm up, stretch up nice and tall, and we're gonna start or finish where we started, which was a really nice stretch going right to the side of the body. Except this time, we're gonna slide the elbow down and just increase that a little. Hold that for a nice count of four. Very slowly bring it up, change sides, bring the arm up as high as you can, lean over to the side, then grab the support and slide that down and come over a little bit more. We're just going to hold this stretch. Very slowly bring it back up again. You can walk the feet in now. Again like we did before, we're going to stretch out the calves. Very important to stretch these out. If you don't, get very tight Achilles tendons tight hamstrings, it all leads into a tight back. It's a very important muscle to stretch out. Hold for four. And while we're here, bend down the back leg. Nice Achilles tendon stretch as well. Look after your legs and they will look after you. It applies with most of, the, of your body, really. Bring it in. There's no time like the present to get into a fitness routine. Never too old, never too young. All you have to do is adapt exercises to suit your body, suit whatever age you're at, and of course your motivation. Okay, keep that stretch in there. You know, it's important to remember that bodies are made to move. It's actually unnatural not to do any exercise at all. Bend down through there for the Achilles tendon. So even if you're just doing a bit of a 10 minute walk, walking to work, any light exercise is really better than nothing at all. So remind yourself of that good fact and of course your friends. Bring it in and roll up to the spine. Take your time coming up. Take one leg behind. Okay, push the hip out to the side. Get a nice stretch down through the ITV. If you're a regular viewer on Aerobics All Style, which you apparently appear to be, why don't you tell your friends about us as well and get them into a really good exercise regime. They will thank you for it, of course, in time. When they feel a little bit better, maybe you can work out as a group as well. We do give you a lot of tips on the show too. Pass them on to your friends. They really will thank you. 
wonder how you became so knowledgeable. You can tell them it's from aerobics or style. Bring it in slowly. Shake it out. Okay, other leg behind. Also want to thank all the letters I've been getting from overseas people lately. It's really quite odd. So wherever you're watching around the world, of course. Well, thank you for watching us. I hope you do enjoy the show. And of course, our sunny shores, which you're not seeing today. We're in the studio, but uh, naturally uh, we're out on location most times, and I hope you enjoy that as well. Hold this just for a few more counts. So, of course, where you should feel it is down through the ITB. It runs right down the side there. Hold for four more counts. Okay, bring it in and into a hamstring stretch. Bring one leg forward, lean down, keep the back flat, and hold that there. Now the foot, I've, I have uh, flexed. It doesn't really matter if you have it down or up. I prefer this stretch here, just increases it for me, but everybody's a little bit different. Roll up to the spine as we change legs. Bring it down slowly. And again, hold the position. Try and stick the backside right out. You may not want to, but that's what I want you to do. Okay, let's roll it up. Take your time coming up. Legs back apart again, take the uh, head off to one side. Try and relax, and then roll the head around. This is always my favorite stretch. Especially when I get the chin to the chest, I really feel a nice release through my back. But let's go around there, one more time. Okay, bring it up, roll the shoulder around. And of course, that's where we're gonna leave you today. So until we see you on our next workout, have a great day, whatever you're doing. Look forward to your company then.